Today, we will explain why your Garmin watch shows the correct altitude value when you are in the 3000 meter high mountain, but the barometric pressure doesn't change a lot while the altitude changes. It is because the Garmin barometer shows the mean sea level pressure. If you have watched the weather forecast before, you will know that if the atmospheric pressure of a place is lower, the weather might become worse. If the atmospheric pressure of a place is higher, the weather might be more stable. Besides the weather, another factor that can affect the atmospheric pressure is the elevation. For every 100 meters of rise, the atmospheric pressure drops by about 10 hectopascals. After understanding these two concepts, let's go back to these two values on the Garmin watch, the ambient pressure and the barometric pressure. The ambient pressure considers both weather and elevation factors. It shows the pressure of your current location. Therefore, the higher the elevation is, the lower the ambient pressure will be. The barometric pressure doesn't count the factor of elevation. It only shows the mean sea level pressure of your location. So that is why the barometric pressure doesn't change significantly. Also, we should know that the value the Central Weather Bureau provides is the mean sea level pressure as well. Therefore, by comparing these two mean sea level pressures, you can know the atmospheric pressure of current location is higher or lower. If the barometric pressure is relatively low, the weather will more likely become worse. If the barometric pressure is higher than the value of the Central Weather Bureau, the possibility of having a sunny day will be higher. For forecasting the weather, the barometric pressure is more useful than the ambient pressure. This is why you can see this value on your Garmin watch. Now I believe everyone knows the difference between the ambient pressure and the barometric pressure. If you want to add the ambient pressure into your data screen field, please check this video.